The Hatco drop-in hot-cold well is easy to operate. Let us show you how. To operate in the hot mode, you must first install the water baffle with the probe designation mark and match it to the location on the water level probe in the unit. Then install the pan platforms that support your food pans. The number of pan platforms is determined by the size of the well. The yellow drain lever must be in the closed or forward position to operate in the hot mode. The drain position indicator light will confirm the drain is closed. Move the power switch to the right or hot position. The hot digital temperature controller will activate and the current temperature of the unit will appear on the display. The auto fill system will fill the well and the water level probe will maintain the correct water level automatically. During the initial preheat, the well will heat quicker and more efficiently with empty food pans installed in the well. The active symbol will show the hydro heater is heating the well. The unit is preset to 192 degrees Fahrenheit, 89 degrees Celsius. Allow approximately 60 minutes for the unit to reach set point temperature. Check the hot digital temperature controller to see that the unit has reached the proper temperature. Replace the empty pans with food pans loaded with your preheated food. There are several important points that apply to both hot and cold operation. Always use a food pan. Do not place food directly into the well and stir thick food items periodically for uniform heating or cooling. Amazing! The food choices look so good, it vanished. We have to get ready for an express salad bar anyway in this same location. To shut down the hot mode, move the power switch to the center or off position. The hydro heater and autofill will be deactivated. After every use, be sure the unit is fully drained and all food pans, water baffle, and pan platforms are removed, cleaned, and stored after each use. Follow both the daily cleaning and periodically the cleaning the hydro heater instructions in the installation and operating manual. For cold mode, the well should be cooled down, clean, dry, and empty of water baffle and pan platforms. We suggest approximately 60 minutes or more to transition between modes in this unit. Keep in mind, the cold mode only operates if the yellow drain lever is in the open or back position. Install the drain pan support bars. Each well can hold a variety of combinations. Shown are two full-size and three one-third size food pans. During the initial cooling time, the well will chill quicker with empty food pans installed in the well. Move the power switch to the left or cold position and the current temperature will appear in the cold digital temperature controller. A five-minute program delay acts as a safeguard when switching from hot to cold mode. This ensures that all possible hot water is drained and prevents unnecessary cooling. After five minutes, an active symbol will appear to show that the condensing unit is chilling the well. The unit is preset to a cold temperature of 32 degrees Fahrenheit, 0 degrees Celsius. Allow approximately 60 minutes for the unit to reach set point temperature. Once the digital controller shows the proper set point temperature, replace the empty pans with pans loaded with your pre-chilled food. Mmm, tasty salad bar items at optimum serving temperatures. Incredible how quickly these items disappear. To shut down the cold mode, move the power switch to the center or off position. The cold digital temperature controller and condensing unit will shut off. Follow both daily cleaning and periodically the cleaning the condensing unit instructions in the installation and operating manual. Check the temperatures for food safeness on the HATCO website before changing the set points. The range for cold digital temperature controller is 10 degrees Fahrenheit to 50 degrees Fahrenheit, minus 12 Celsius to 10 degrees Celsius. The temperature range for the hot controller is 65 degrees Fahrenheit to 192 degrees Fahrenheit, 18 degrees Celsius to 89 degrees Celsius. 
To change the set point, press and hold the set key until the display flashes the default of 32 degrees. We will show changing the cold mode here. To change the hot mode set point, follow the same procedure. Press the up or down key to increase or decrease the temperature. If no key is pressed within 60 seconds, the display will revert to the previous set point and the current temperature will be shown. Set point changes should be made in 1 to 2 degree increments. Wait approximately 1 hour or more for any change before checking for the result. Press the key to lock in your new set point temperature. The display will show the current temperature of the unit. The installation and operating manual goes into more detail about installing, operating, cleaning and other panel functions of Hatco's Hot Cold Drop-In Well. Check out the new video, How Do You Clean the Hatco FR2 Rethermalizer, Bain Marie Heater and 3CS2 Sanitizing Sink Heater on the Hatco website under Video Library for easy hot mode cleaning tips. If you have any questions or the unit requires service, contact your local HATCO dealer, sales representative, HATCO customer service, or visit www.hatcocorp.com for more information. Our Knock Your Socks Off customer service is here for you.